where we okay now I'm at the Lobo store here in Chicago and this is a problem okay I just received this today this package today I thought it was gonna come Monday but it came early all right now this here are the bottles okay this is the real and this is the fake this is the fake because look at the top of it. It's shiny around the edges, around the beveled edges. And this one is matte, and there are no beveled ed edges. And it looks kind of scratched up and gnarly, and that's something that is definitely telling that it's a, a fake. This came from Texas, as a matter of fact. Okay, underneath the fake one, the bottle is real concave. Concave and, and smooth. If you can see that, got my thumb out of the way. So if you can see that, see, that's fake. Look at that. Now, if you look at the real one, the real one is thicker. It's thicker, have more like a little bubble on it in the bottom of it, and it's a little rounded underneath. And also, look at the glass and look at the marking. See that marking right there? Yeah, that's the real. This is the real thing. Okay, now when you come over here, when it comes to the boxes, here's a problem. Okay, look at their boxes. This is the fake box. The fake box is ribbed. It's ripped. You can feel that. The fake box is ripped. Also, if you look at the label, the label appears kind of shiny, right? All right. Their labels aren't shiny. Their labels are just like their tops. Their labels are matte. They don't, there's no shine. I know this is looking at a, you know, what, a Broxide uh, 17. Yeah, but this is a real label from the real store that I'm standing in. And notice there is no shine to it. That's because this is real. Also, if you look at it underneath it, let's turn the boxes over and have a look see, Look at it. Okay, now look. You see this? This one is the real box. Look how small the markers are underneath it. See that? What they did with the fake ones is that they blew them up. Right here, they blew them up, and they have all this other writing underneath it. These guys went all out to fake this. They did a pretty good job on it, making sure that... Um, it says, you know, 233, you know, Elizabeth Street, New York and stuff like that, which is the original places. They went all out to make sure that the labels were the same, but the label is fake. So this is the best way to know that this is also fake. Also, when you spray another 13, the original, it comes out thicker and it's real strong. This right here comes out very thin and misty, very thin and misty. I'm gonna spray a little bit of it now so you can see the difference. Comes out very thin and misty. Look at that, very thin and misty. That's because it's alcohol based. As a matter of fact, as I'm walking through the mist, I can smell the alcohol. They use rubbing alcohol instead of original alcohol to, uh, to make this stuff. So this is to let you guys know the fake from the real. I'm really here at the, the Lobo store. I don't wanna show any other employees' faces or anything like that for you know an anonymity and all that stuff like that. Uh, but um, to let you guys know, if you don't get it from a, uh, a reputable place like a department store or the original Lalabo store, it is fake and don't be bothered with bothered. You know, just if you if it's too much for you, you know, buy it, you know, cry later, what have you, but at least you know you got the real. All right guys, take it easy.